Hi, I'm Alex Evans at the Trek product launch for Bike Radar and MB UK. I'm here with Dan McConnell to talk about the brand new Trek cross country race bike. This is obviously the, the new Trek Procal. It's been a fair long time in the making, I guess. We've been on these for a few months now, so it's it's finally good to be able to, you know, share it with everyone and um, you know, get it out there. For a long time hardtails have all been fairly, you know, similar I guess. The biggest difference is the the ISO speed, which um, is really a, a big step and a big game changer in in the hardtails. Now what exactly is the ISO speed? It's pretty straightforward really. So um you know obviously you've seen it with the Damani and the Boone and now onto the um, mountain bike so um basically it just softens the ride, makes it a hell of a lot smoother um, and it just enables you to you know pedal a lot more efficient over the rough stuff and not sort of lose any power and hold your speeds. So it stops you getting a numb bum and also helps you go faster. <laughs> yeah, just over the rough terrain, you can you know stay seated for the for a whole lot longer and just um, you know keep the power down. This is your personal race bike. What stuff do you have on the bike that makes it a bit more special? Is there anything particular? Start with the stem. It's a Pontrega prototype, so it's um, 120 mil with a 25 degree. Um, gives me that really good position for the climbing. You know, it's super aggressive, but it's comfortable and it fits me really well. I'm running um, five at 90 um, bars. Five nine, um, six, six ninety. Six ninety. Sorry, should I start again? Do you want to start again? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> six nineties with ESI grips. These are a, a new grip actually. Just um, came out from ESI, which is you know super comfortable and a fair bit grippier than the old one so i really like that as well and it matches your frame yeah it all looks pretty good the <laughs> mechanics have done a pretty good job making it look fast comes stock with the shimano xtr di2 which is um it's been around for a year now well i've been lucky enough to have it for just over a year comes with fox suspension this is the the new range of Fox with the boost, so um, the bike has boost front and back. Yeah, it does, which um, you know is a really big benefit, especially in the back. Um, you know, allowing for really short chain stays, which you can notice as soon as you get on in the corners, uh, makes it much more flickable and just a more fun ride. Okay, that's really interesting to know. So wheelies, wheelies and skids are, are easier. Yeah, for sure. It sort of um, makes 29er instead of being the the truck that a lot of people say it is. It makes it much more. Um, it makes it a fun bike. I've noticed there's no cables on the outside of the bike. Um, it looks really smart. Can you just tell us a little bit about the routing? Yeah, it's super neat. Everything's got a pretty much internal, so it, you know it looks looks nice and sharp. Yeah, it just gives it a really good finish. Front brake on the right or left? Oh, definitely right. Yeah. 